did the statue, I only lived about an hour and a half from him, so I saw it about three times as he was putting it together. And the, the stockings, you know, fit just right, the gloves are right, the shoes are right. He had everything from the picture that the guys had given him where he could go by. And, uh, so I think, uh, I know I'm happy with him. Uh, I'm sure I will be, and I uh, hope everybody else will. It is very rewarding, really, because you have the greatest player in Mays out there in the statue. You have the most fear hitter in McCovey. You got a hitter to hit the ball to the right field of being a, a, a right handed hitter in Cepeda. And you got a great pitcher, Juan Myers, you know, his best friend and a great pitcher. Four years ago, I never thought I'd touch it. Uh, just so hard to get the statue out well, I signed the Giants right out of high school, so my love has always been with the Giants. I uh, greatly appreciate what they've done for me. When my, my teammates uh, with the Giants, Don, Don drives there and pitches against me, one guy come back out of the strike, and I said, it's on his belt today. The next guy come back, no, it's not, it's on his pants. The next guy said, no, it's on his hat. They worried more about what he was touching than what he was looking so I went home and started practicing that night. That was about 60, 64. Uh, how many times did you have to pitch? I don't keep saying it was so good. Maybe I should have done something like that. Anyway, it was, it was fun to have the hitter sink in myself. I think that's what uh, you get inside the hitter's head. And, what made you so successful? Did you have? Was it basically you had like a sinking fastball, or what? How did you get batters out? The sinking fastball, the slider, and the pitch that helped me most was the fork. I learned that from watching Leroy face and Lenny McDaniel, which was with us in the early uh, sixties, and uh, I would tip my changeup off. It wasn't very good change So the fork ball, I could throw just like a fastball, and it worked good for me. So. You know, the scout that signed me up right out of high school said, hey, you should learn to throw a football. So uh, it took me about third year. I was with uh, San Francisco to uh, work on that to get it perfected.